Hey everybody, another unboxing for Lit Crate. And this time, like I was saying, I'm also going to have a couple of books after this part. So it's going to be more than just Lit Crate unboxing. It's also going to be showing you the two books I got. So there we go. I'll open it up for you guys to see what looks right before me. And that's what it looks like on the inside. Ooh, I, let me see. Ooh, I already see some cute stuff in here. This is the card, and it's called, um, this month's is, um, I forget the title of this month's. It doesn't tell you on here. I forgot what this month's is. Next month's is Pirate Thief. Ooh, it's really pretty. I can't get it, though. Oh, it's called Fallen Kingdom. It says, read me first. Lit Joy Crate enhances the reading experience by picking each item with care. Every item is directly inspired by the book. The booklet explains how each item relates to the book. As you read the book, each item will reveal itself as meaningful. Huh. Well, of course, I'm not going to look yet because there's be spoilers. But I already see some neat stuff. We got, ooh, as Weasley is our king. Oh, I love that. Look at the in, 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 in animal pen, how you say it. <laughs> I can never pronounce that word right. Oh my gosh, this is so awesome. I'll wear that. I like me some Brian Weasley. And I like all the Weasleys. Look at how beautiful. Woohoo, yay. Ooh, we got a bottle. Yes, we do. Ooh, I see something else in here that looks really good. Ooh, wow. I see a couple of really things that look kind of neat in here, you guys. But look at this water bottle it says I will rule the world as soon as I finish one more chapter really pretty and my one of my favorite colors if it would have been green I would have been super happy because green is my favorite but hey purple is my second favorite and this is nice be nice once it starts warming up and I go for walks I'm trying to remember what that one's for. I don't really want to look at spoilers. We'll look afterwards. Ooh, we got some socks. It says, Bring Me My Crown Sunday Stocks by Lit Joy Crate. Lit Joy Crate. Oh, I like these. We have to open it up. If I can get it open here. It says something on it, you guys. Ooh, I love these socks. These are so cute. I'm trying to read what it says. But I don't want to, I'm so afraid this is going to like tear. Hope I don't ruin the socks. Yep, I got it. Ooh, look at how pretty, you guys. It says on here, let me see. <laughs> Do this. See if it'll help, because I can't read what it says. It says, if you can read this. Look at the designs. I think those designs are cute. But it says, if you can read this, bring me my crown. <laughs> I love that. Bring me my crown. That is awesome. I like how they do this. Like, everything has something to do with the book. I think that's so neat. I'm liking everything so far. The, wand, the Weasley pen. The sip cup. The water bottle, whatever you want to say. The socks. There's a couple more things in here. One more thing, I think, before the book. And there's a print as well. Ooh, I like the print. I'll show you the print first. Look at how beautiful. Oh, my gosh. Oh, I love it. I love this print so much. I think that's supposed to be Dorian, is it? Or is that somebody else? Or is it Dorian? Better be Dorian. Or it could be the person in the book. I don't know. Oh, I think it's Ross. Ro wow. It ain't, uh, it ain't, um, it ain't Dorian. It's, um, Rossan, 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 how do you say his name? Reeson? Reeson, how do you say it? From the Court of Throne and Roses series. 
That's who it is. That's a nice print of him. I never, I always forget what Rysan looks like. I know that he's supposed to be good looking, but I always forget. But look at this. It says something, Courage, Dear Heart, C.S. Lewis. Cool. Hmm. Just a notepad, but hey, it's got lines, you guys. A notebook, but it's got lines. I always like the ones with lines. But look at this design. Isn't that gorgeous? I like how it says, Courage, dear heart. That's really cute. Like, I got stuff all over the place, you guys. So much stuff. What's this? It's like a, just a little card from them saying happy holidays. Thank you, you guys. It says, happy holidays. Lick Joy owner Alex and Kelly here. We want to take a moment to thank you for making 2018 a truly magical year. Highlights from this year include. And then it talks about the different highlights, the different uh, trading cards that they started doing. Um, talk about now having only book only subscriptions. Yeah. And then it says, P.S. As a Special thank you. We would love to offer you 10% off any item from LitJoy shop. Head to the shop, Lit Crate Joy, and make sure to use your code. Blah, blah, blah. Hmm, what is this supposed to be? Oh, it's a little, okay. Just another thing for them, it says. We also extended a $2 coupon off anything at Lit Crate Joy event. During your January subscription. It says, as a thank you to loyal customers, we are including extra book in every January young adult crate and book only. This is, this is right. Every January young adult product will include two books. One new release title and one companion title, both hardback. Mm. Cool. I don't think I'm going to get it, though, because I don't have that much money, but... That's awesome that they're doing that. Right, that's really cool. And the book. Yes, the book. Okay, we're finally to the book. And we got our cards that they always give you. Which I'm looking forward to. If I can get the book open. The book is Once a King. I can't get the darn thing open. There we go. I'm glad they don't put 50 million things in here. I just did all crate and there was so many, um, you know, um, what do they call it? Worms in that all crate one. Like I was going insane trying to get everything. Now these are the, that's why I was thinking the other thing was, um, was, um, that's why I was thinking the other ones were, um, were, uh, what's it called? You know, um, uh, with Dorian. Because I think these were supposed to, these are supposed to be the, but I'm not sure who they are. I'm not sure who these are supposed to be. But they're neat. Let me see. Well, we'll look at the book first and then we'll see. But I like this cover. Once a King by Aaron Sum Sumrell? Sumrell? Something like that? Oh, and here's the um, the print, and then the letter from the author, or, yeah, it's really pretty, and signed, this is like a comp companion novel to another book that she does, ooh, look at how pretty, Says one secret corp one secret corrupts a realm. Ooh, another map. You guys know me with maps. How crazy I get with maps. I freaking love maps. Hello, Beetle. Um I'll not be returning in time for a summit. Says, oh. Says praise forever the hunted. Absolutely marvelous. Okay. 
Well, I'm not going to say what it's about, but yeah, it looks like it's going to be good. <laughs> Which is funny, because I'm going to show you in a minute why this is funny. You know what? I like everything in this box. There ain't one thing I don't, I don't like. I love everything. This is so gorgeous. Very, very gorgeous. I love it. I love how it feels and everything. But you'll see why I was... Say why I was just laughing when I show you what I got from Amazon now. Well, let, first we'll talk about this box. Definitely my favorite thing. Oh my gosh, you know, it's hard to, like, tell you what my favorite thing is. I'm a huge Harry Potter fan, of course, so... And I love the Weasley family, so besides Percy, so yeah. Definitely think this is one of my favorites. I have to say this and the socks. No, this and the water bottle, I would say, are my two favorites. Okay, now let's see if we can get here before I show you why I was kind of laughing just a second ago. I love this, too. All right, let me get to this. <sighs> okay, here we go. Okay, this is Kings of Narnia Notebook. As we dove into the pages of our Once a King, we were reminded of Lucy, Susan, Peter, and Edmund when they ventured into the wardrobe. They had no idea that their adventures would eventually lead to them being crown royalty. Cool. Definitely cool. And then it says, where did I put it? Where'd you go, baby? I can't find what I did with, oh, there it is. This one says, Weasley is our king in the enamel pen. Weasley can save anything. He never leaves a single ring. That's why Gryffindor all sing, Weasley is our king. <laughs> well, he can't technically... Why he isn't technically a ruler, I mean, of a country, Ron Weasley will always be one of our favorite knights or kings. And as once a king portrays the spirit of the underdog, we knew we had to pay homage, homage to our favorite underdog king. Ah, And then it says, for the socks, it says, Royal Crown Socks. You'll have to pretend your crown, your crown wearing days were in another life. It says, in once a king, there is a danger, blah, 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 blah. I don't want to read that part in case you guys haven't read the book yet. It says, and we may not have fit a royal crown in each and every crate. You can still feel like royalty when you wear these crowns at your feet or on your feet. These lit joy design socks will leave no doubt that you are truly royalty awesome 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 let's see print i don't know where i sat him there he is it says i will bow to no one and nothing but my crown sarah j mass at court of miss and fury when we think of the weight of a kingdom resting upon a king's shoulders we are reminded of another litter Literacy King, Rysan. We hope you enjoy Tara's or Tara's beautiful. De, how do you say that? Rylet, right? Rysan, Death Incarnated Night Triumph. Oh, this is a mouthful. Yeah, throw the glass. These are throw the glass. I thought they were. Okay. The rumor holds some truth. I am the youngest ruler at the summit. My people are divided between support and opposition for ch channels and something like that has been awakened, but I won't be my father. The story of a young prince trying to overcome his father's tyrant, how do you say that, world, immediately reminds us of Dorian and his struggle for his kingdom. We included Sliana, Sliana, Selena. Rowan, and Rowan, because it is their friendship that makes Dorian story possible, and they are on a journey to save a kingdom in ruins. 
cool. So, I that's why I got confused because I knew that there was going to be something in here that was going to have Dorian. So when I saw that, I just thought, okay, Dorian, but no. <laughs> but we did have Dorian, so. I am really happy with this box. Like I said, I don't know which one I wouldn't, wouldn't pick. But look at this, you guys. If you guys are buying next month's or thinking about buying next month's, look how gorgeous you get one of these bracelets. If I had the money, I would do this. Cause this is gorgeous. It says, every January crate comes with a pirate-themed charm bracelet exclusive from Lit Crate Joy. Mm-hmm. Not this exact charm bracelet. This was our exclusive Muse of Nightmare charm bracelet. So you don't get this one, but you're getting a charm bracelet. So, still beautiful. This is really, like, really cute. Yeah. So, next month, like I said, is pirate theme. If I had the money, I would get that. Because, like I said, like I read, they're going to have two books next month in theirs. But I would have to choose between this and Beacon. And Beacon... Next month is going to have um, spare uh, is going to have a new uh, a regular book and an arch that doesn't come out until April, so I have to get that one because <laughs> I've been wanting an arch. Okay, now I'm going to show you guys the two books and why I was laughing because I got the other two books, Ever the Hunted and Ever the Brave. I actually think I read Ever the Hunted or I started it. I can't remember if I finished it. But I had it in um ebook and I just have not been in the mood to read ebooks. Ooh, this one has a map in it, you guys. It says Ever the Outcast, Ever the Brave. Look at this. Another map. It says how can you track down a killer when he's the boy who stole your heart? 17-year-old Brit Britta Flannery is at ease only in the woods with her dagger and bow. She spends her days tracking criminals alongside her father, the legendary bounty hunter for the king of Malam, something like that. That is until her father is murdered. The alleged killer is her father's former apprentice, the only friend she's ever known, the boy she once loved. Who broke her heart. She must go on a dangerous quest in a world of wearing kingdoms, mad kings, and dark magic to find her father's murderer and bring him to justice. But Bretta wields more power than she knows, and soon she will learn what has always made her different will make a daunting and dangerous force. Ever the hunter ensures, ensnares me from the very first page. Absolutely marvelous. Sarah J. Moss. New York Times bestselling author of Throne of Glass Books. Yeah. So, yeah. I actually knew what the book was going to be. So, I wanted to get these two. Even though it's like a companion. But I didn't know if there was going to be any spoilers. You know, or anything. Because sometimes companions can have spoilers. So, that's why I got these two first. But now I got these two. And I got... Companion! Yay! So, I'm going to have some fun next year. It says, Erin Summers is the author of Ever the Hunted and Ever the Brave. She lives in Utah with her family. So, yeah. So, I'm really excited. So, I got a lot of books from her to read. Yay. So, yay, yay. <laughs> and then I wanted to show you one more thing. And then I am done, you guys, with this these boxes for today. Oh, boy. I've never had this much mail in one day. And I got some different Sharpies. You know I annotate, if you guys watch my channel. The other ones I got yesterday, some of them are okay, but some aren't. So we're going to try these. You guys, I'm trying every single type until I find that one that's going to work. That is one of my goals for next year, which I will talk about when I do my goals for next year. Is definitely because I want to, like, you know, start doing one. Well, we'll go into that later when I do that thing, but yeah. Don't want to go into it on here. But yeah, that's the other thing I got. I am done, you guys. <sighs> what? Okay. What was your favorite thing out of the box that I did just now? Uh, like I said, I don't know which one. I would have to say. I definitely love this because, like I said, I love the Weasley family. So I love this. The only thing that would have beat this is if it would have had um, 
Luna or Hermione. That's the only thing that would have beat that. But yeah, I have to say the pin and the bottle has to be my favorite. I love the bottle. I love the socks too, though. I like everything. Like all three boxes that I did today on box had at least one or two things that I really loved in it. So yeah. But this one is definitely one of my favorites. But that is it. I'm going to let you guys go. You guys got a lot of videos of mine to watch. Three today. All unboxing. So let me know in each of the video what was your favorite thing. Yay! I am so excited. I still got a lot of more boxes coming in the next few weeks. I'm about to lose my throat, so my voice, so I'm going to quit in a second. And put all the stuff away because I got stuff all over my bed because I've been unboxing. I unboxed, in case you didn't see the other two, I unboxed Beacon Book Box, and I also unboxed Owl Crate, and Owl Lit Crate, and I showed you my little stuff. So, yeah, and as soon as more comes, we'll do some more unboxings, and I am going to let you guys go. Uh -oh. I go, hope you guys have a great day, and yeah, I hope you enjoy all of these unboxings that I did today. And now I gotta do the fun stuff of cleaning everything up. So, I hope you guys enjoyed this. Like I said, if you guys haven't subscribed yet, think about subscribing. If you do, bell icon so you'll know whenever a video like this is uploaded. Excuse me. If you liked the video, please, please, please thumb up. And yeah, just comment down below and let me know what your favorite item was. If you guys have any book boxes coming. Or if you guys already had some and you guys want me to watch your guys', just link it down below and I will watch what you guys got. Yeah. Okay. I hope you guys all have a great weekend. I'm going to go back to reading because I have not been reading that much. And I was going to do a read-a-thon, so yeah. But yeah, that is it. I hope you guys all have a great day, a fun weekend, and I will talk to you guys all in my next video.